Hey everyone, welcome back to Drive It Out. My name is Adam and I have just arrived at the BMW Performance Driving Center in South Carolina. Spartansburg, Greer, South Carolina right here. And I am so excited to be here. I'm all about upgrading the driver and gaining new experiences and that's what we're gonna do in here. So I'm looking forward to showing you what's going on in here and I'm really excited to get behind the wheel, all right? Right away, guys, you notice that they put a lot of heart and effort into this facility. This is not an afterthought. They truly want you to experience these vehicles. They have great facilities. they got classrooms. Really going to let you know what you are in for before you go out there. And just right outside the facility, right out back, they've got cars for days. And there's track. And you see people doing exercises back here. And check out this guy doing the circle here. <laughs> gotta love it I love that sound and they're getting after it guys they have the racetracks here in the back but they also have an off-road section as well and that is where I started my day I was in the x5m and I did this off-road course and it was quite fun you see us going through the water here and this was a really cool course. Uh, it, it wasn't, it varied, you know, it wasn't just cookie cutter. You could kind of go different ways and do different obstacles and kind of pick and choose. And so I got to do some water stuff and some hill climb stuff. And it was very, very awesome. You get to see the vehicle and the off-road modes and what it's capable of and helping you out. And these are incredibly capable video vehicles on and off-road, these X5s. But I was most excited for what I did after that, and that was getting on track. And you can see here the five different vehicles I would be driving on track. And here I am. Check this out. This is the Z4, and I was super stoked to be in here. Oh, yeah. I, I wanted you guys to experience some of the sound. Air being in the open air driving, I, I was really starting to get used to the course at this time. went from the Z4 and I just kept stepping up in size and weight um, but I go to the M2 competition after this now I, I I really enjoyed that Z4 but this M2 by far was my favorite car of the day it, it felt very muscle car like um, while having very much sports car attributes it handled extremely well um, but it, the way it grunted the way it sounded and the way it felt it felt like a muscle car that had been trained and made to fit the track experience. That was great. Um, the M4 was fantastic as well, but again, I continue to go up in size here of car as I'm going to get all the way to an SUV. I jump from the M4 to the M5 competition here, and all of these handle extremely well. It's about what kind of experience that you want. Now, I will say that as you go up, you definitely get more and more insulated. The experience in that M5 was very quiet and smooth in there, but it was very capable. And then there in the X3 at the end in the SUV, I did not get to drive the M3. That's what I'm pictured with here. That was the only vehicle that I did not get to drive while I was there, but I did drive six other vehicles, the Z4, the M2 competition, M4 competition, M5 competition, X3 M competition, and that X5M in the off-road course, and the experience was just fantastic. I definitely challenge you guys to get out there. Go find yourself a driving experience like this. Get some track experience. I just did this in a, in a, a few hours. It wasn't even a half day, but I got to have some professional instruction, and then I got to get behind the wheel and get my hands on things and actually experience what things feel like and feel feedback from the road and feedback from the track and feedback from off-road and put yourself in these situations that are where you're really getting the most out of what these vehicles were designed for. These guys, engineers, designed these cars with passion and purpose and they really wanted them to have these great capabilities and we don't really experience what these cars are capable of from a day-to-day -day basis. So whether you are buying a new BMW or you are just thinking about it um, or maybe you just want a really good solid experience getting behind the wheel on track for the first time and, and kind of seeing what different variants of cars and models are like on track 
go to one of these facilities. I also uh, have a video coming out soon going to the Porsche facility in Atlanta, and that was spectacular as well. But if you get a chance to go out to South Carolina, check out the BMW Performance Driving Center. It was absolutely fantastic. Guys, get out there and drive. It's so much fun. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this quick video. I'm, I'm going around and getting these driving experiences, and I'm really enjoying showing you guys these because that is what all of my endeavors started for. The whole purpose was to go out and gain new driving experiences. So thanks for following along, and I hope you guys will subscribe, and I will show you guys some more experiences coming up soon, and you can always count on us for your reviews, uh, your walk-around reviews, your in-depth reviews, and your car comparisons. So Thanks again, guys. We will see you in the next review.